Hello everyone and welcome to week two of our tendinopathy course. Uh, week one's been very good so far. It's been great to see all of you in there and to see the discussions taking place. Um, I hope that you've enjoyed week one. So we're moving on to week two. Uh, this week it's going to be all about normal tendon biomechanics and physiology and function. Um, so more about function than physiology. And also then looking at pathophysiology in tendinopathy. So how tendinopathies occur, what's going on, and just so that we can have a really good understanding of what's going on in the tendon. And that will help us when we come to assessing and treating the tendons, which we'll be covering in weeks three and four. So another, I'm afraid, quite theoretical week, and, and I'm sorry to say that there's a lot of reading in there, but you know, it, it's really important reading, and um, I hope that you'll enjoy it. It's really good to get this uh, sort of basis of theoretical knowledge so that you can move on and really understand why we're doing what we're doing when we're assessing and treating individuals with tendinopathy. Um, there are a couple of good discussions this week. One, we're starting off with one discussion this week that I hope will stimulate quite a lot of discussion amongst the people in the course. And then at the end of the week, we've got another literature search. Now, I just wanted to talk to you about the literature search. When we ask you to do this in, in the discussion forums, what we're really asking you to do is search around all the journals and research that's available online and post a link to the articles that you have found. We don't need you to copy what's in the articles or copy the abstract. All we really need is a link to the article and a really short summary of what the article says, what the take home message is from that article. So then, you know, in that discussion, we'll have a, you know, over a hundred articles posted and a really quick summary. So it's something that we can all learn from. So just bear that in mind when you do the second discussion this week, which is another literature search. You know, we're trying to create a sort of library of literature that we can refer to. It's not about testing your knowledge. It, we're just trying to create more of a resource that we can all learn from. Um, so yeah, so bear that in mind. But this week is going to be good. Uh, we have, we don't have any interviews with experts this week. We're saving those for week three and four. What there is, is a, um, a webinar video from one of the other monsters of tendinopathy and you'll hear about that from Seth in week four but um, it, we haven't made it a required video because it's very long and some people may not be able to stream it all but it's well worth watching so I would advise you to try and find the time to watch that video as well as the other things in week two. So have a good week, um, enjoy, please engage, um, help each other out in the discussion forums if you have any questions ask them of us in the discussion forums and we'll do our best to answer them for you or we'll save them to ask some of the experts that we interview later on and try and find out the questions for you. So have a good week and I'll see you in the discussion forums.